Hi everyone, my name is Victor and I'm one of the authors of Technique.com. Today we're going to continue with our RHC SA8 series and we're going to continue with network management in Linux explain with examples. In our previous videos, we've looked at a lot of things. We've looked at network manager, we've looked at what network services, we've looked at network configuration files, we've looked at how to set the IP address by directly editing the network configuration file. We've also looked at how to set an IP address by using the NMCLR utility. So in this video, we're going to look at how to set the IP address in Red Hat 8 using the NMTUI utility. So for example, we're going to set this um, IP addresses, having um, the IPv, IPv4 address to be this, the subnet mask to be this, gateway, this address, and DNS, this address. So how do we go about it? The first step to take is to initialize the text utility interface by running by running the nmtui command. All right, and um, we're going to edit a connection. All right, we want to edit the ens three three connection, and then um, so what you're going to do is you navigate to the um, edit. All right, so you're just going to set your you can see the profile name, which is the connection name here, the device, which is the NIC. All right, so IPv4 configuration, it's already manual. If you want it to be um, DHCP, you're going to set it to be automatic. <coughs> so it is manual. We're just going to set this IP to what we want to set it to. All right. So um, what we're trying to do is to make this 10 dot dot and I just have a lot of issues with my dot key dot um 15 All right so the next step is to set the gateway ten dot ten dot Ninety-nine. Right. So the next step is to set the DNS server. Which is in dot zero dot one dot three. Okay. So you can just scroll down. If you have other IP addresses, you can click on hard here. If you have, have other, I mean, you can press or enter on the hard um, tab here. Right. If you have other DNS servers, you can do the same thing. Then you can just scroll down and then you click on OK. You're not actually clicking, you're navigating and pressing the Enter key. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to remove this. And I'm going to make sure I click OK. I mean, I press Enter on OK key. <laughs> All right, and um, you're going to go back. And here you're going to say OK. So you can restart your network manager service. Restart. OK, so let's see if it's changed. It has not changed, so we need to restart the network interface. So I guess I've lost connection because I'm logged in via um, SSH. So I'll just go to the console to, um, let's see if I can even just um, restart here. Oh, obviously I cannot restart because the IP has changed. So I'm just going to um, go to the console and log in via the console. So I've logged in via the console. So let's um, check the interface again. Okay, so you can see that the IP has changed. Okay, so um, this is how you're going to 
set the static IP using the NMTUI utility. All right. So thank you for watching and please subscribe to this channel. In the next video, we're going to look at how to set the uh, a static IP address using the GUI. Using the GUI. All right. Thank you. And please subscribe to this channel. Bye for now.